Los Angeles police believe they've nabbed the most prolific serial killer in the city's history. No case is too old or too cold. John Floyd Thomas Jr. is accused of raping and strangling as many as 30 older women over two decades in Southern California. The 72-year-old insurance claims adjuster is no stranger to the law and has been in and out of jail since the 1950s. So far, he's been charged with murdering two women, one in 1972 and one in 1976. The break in the cold case came in October when Thomas, who had twice been convicted of sexual assault, had a DNA sample taken as part of an effort to build an offender database. Through DNA, Thomas has been linked to two LAPD cold case homicides and to three other murders being investigated by the Inglewood Police Department and Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department. Thomas at this time, at this time, and we believe this will probably expand, is also suspected in as many as 25 other murders and scores of rapes that occurred in the Southland during the 1970s and 1980s. The victims in all 30 cases under review were older women, often widows living alone. All had been sexually assaulted and most were strangled. Police are clearly overjoyed to have cracked the old cases. Today we're pleased to report that a very significant number of those very old and very cold cases we believe have now been solved. And as importantly, there are many more that we believe continued investigation will help to solve. Thomas is being held on $1 million bond. Friends say he is married and has children. Myra Lopez, The Associated Press.